Hi friends, in this video we are going to learn the assignment operator in C. So the assignment operator can be used to assign values to the variables. So see a program here, in the main function we are declaring an integer variable a and initializing to 10. And next we are declaring another integer variable b and we have b equal to a. So that is the assignment operator and the equal to symbol is the assignment operator in C. And what happens here is that the value of A is assigned to variable B. So 10 will be stored in B also. Now we are printing the values of A and B and see the output it will be 10, 10. And basically what happens is that the value of right side operand will be assigned to the left side operand. But there are more compound assignment operators and we are going to see them. First we have plus equal to which means left and right operands will be added and the result will be assigned to the left operand and it is equivalent to writing a equal to a plus b. Then we have minus equal to which means right operand will be subtracted from left operand and the result will be assigned to the left operand and it is the same as writing a equal to a minus b. Next is star equal to which means the product of left and right operand will be calculated and the result will be assigned to the left operand and it is same as writing a equal to a into b. Next we have divided by equal to which means the left operand is divided by right operand and the quotient is assigned to the left operand and this is same as writing a equal to a divided by b. Next we have percentage equal to and here after left and right operand division the remainder will be stored in left operand. Now let us see examples and let a equal to 10 and b equal to 5. And we have a plus equal to b and as we said it is equivalent to a equal to a plus b so we will get a equal to 15. Next we have a minus equal to b so that is equal to a equal to a minus b and we get a equal to 5. And next is a into equal to b that is a equal to a into b and we get a equal to 50. Next is a divided by equal to b that is a equal to a divided by b and we get a equal to 2. Next is a mode equal to b and it is same as a equal to a mode b and we get a equal to 0. So let us see an example program and we have the main function and we are declaring integer variables a equal to 10 and b equal to 5. Then we are calculating a plus equal to b and we are printing the value of a as a plus b so the output will be 15. Hi guys, now you can get a lot of features in the official log to base 2 website, easy registration and login process and once you log in, you can access a lot of amazing courses. You can watch the visual tutorials. You can see the examples, solve puzzles and finally practice problems all in a single page. Visit www.log2base2.com where learning is fun and beautiful. And don't forget to let us know your thoughts on this.